vlog we're gonna be doing a little like get ready for a big event with me today is august 30th which is the day before my opening night of my gallery at nc states african american cultural center entitled her black hand a conversational piece where i am the prize artist who gets to be featured um, 13 of my poems will be in that gallery along with some local rally artists that I've selected and so I'm really excited but I have a lot of stuff that I need to get done prior to I still have to drop off some artwork that people sent to me I have to mail off some bookmarks do some stuff for my nails my hair my outfit is not complete so that will be a part of this vlog and so there's just a lot of little things that needs to get done before tomorrow so that tomorrow can go smoother so that is what today's vlog is going to be about I just got the shower I'm about to make me a smoothie and get my day started our day is getting started a little bit late so I need to feed Eris so I'm probably gonna do that before I make my smoothie because he is trying to go outside but he needs to eat before he goes outside it's been pretty hot in North Carolina lately like we had a couple weeks where it was a little cool and I'm like oh it's fall falling but um it's back hot so I need to feed Eris and I am out of Purina because Purina has been low-key having a shortage at all the grocery stores and he has to have like not special Purina but like his vet recommended a different food for him but I have cat people because we did a collab with them a couple months ago so we still have some of the stuff that they sent um and he really likes it so i don't mind giving it to him he's a very picky eater he doesn't like a lot of different brands of food you know i've tried a couple he pretty much only eats purina i give him sheba sometimes as a treat because target has this like alfredo one that he really likes but um yeah we have two different bowls today because i'm currently washing eris's um bowls today we usually i mean i try to swap them out i have he has some pretty cute bowls so yeah his other place and that is also getting washed right now so we're using this one i got a dollar tree which also is fine because he doesn't really care but um yes this this bowl this like elevated bowl is also from cat people and we really like it it's really cute to to me it's really cute i think it helps because he doesn't like to eat on the ground yeah so they're like i said they're very few cute foods that Eris will eat he's very like picky um he'll eat it on the floor which is also why I need a placemat because even though he puts it on the placemat he'll take it to like the living room and eat it on the carpet he'll bring it to my bedroom and eat it there so like I guess the placemat is just like it's really just for aesthetic because the food never makes it onto the placemat um but you know I don't mind cleaning up he's my baby so He's just going to eat his breakfast while I make my smoothie. I also forgot that me and Nick plan to go to Taco Tuesday. Like, if you are in Raleigh and you have not heard of Crystal the Muse, where do you live? Under a rock? Look her up. She's fucking phenomenal. She's like one of the best hosts ever. Energy is always amazing. Outfits on point. But um, we're going to go to Taco Tuesday because I have been wanting to go. But, like, I'm an old lady. So, like, by, 10, by the time 10 o'clock hit, because that's when the event really starts, um, I'll, be, I'll be in my pajamas in the bed. So um we're gonna go today. Nick Nick, we committed ourselves to going. So we're gonna we're gonna go today. That means I really have to get all of my things on my to-do list done to set myself up for success tomorrow. Because this is self-love. You know how, you know, women, we like to go out of our way for our man, but like go out of your way for yourself. Like you think your man will like a little pack lunch? Pack your own lunch. You think your man will like when you lay his clothes out? Lay your own clothes out. Prepare yourself. I remember one day when I was at work. I had woke up early, you know what I'm saying, laid out a little outfit for me to come home to. And it was kind of like a little gift to myself because as the day progressed, I completely forgot that I had did that. But when I got home, it was like, oh my God, that's so nice. And that's like one thing that I didn't have to do. So like do something nice for yourself, like treat yourself. That's like self-love. People talk about like the self-affirming part of self-love. Self-love is doing things that you do for others for yourself. So like if you want to come home to a cooked meal, like maybe meal prep the night before so that when you get home the next day, you don't have to be so stressed out or bogged out about cooking. Because even though I like to cook, there are multiple days where I'm like, oh my God, feeding myself again. I just did this twice. So yeah, so we're just gonna, I'll probably watch, actually no, we're not gonna watch TV, Discipline. Cause I really want to finish my show. Hmm. I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna finish my smoothie. I'm gonna get dressed and I'm gonna catch up with y'all in the car. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay. So as you can see, I have the paintings in the back ready to be dropped off. One is for my best friend, Deja, who is my Neo. And then the other one is for my friend, Jelani, who is Deja's Neo. So, you know, the reds are in the building when it comes to my gallery. Ooh! Taurus, comment, because I know y'all be watching. I know y'all be watching. Um, sorry if it's shaking. Y'all are attached to the windshield with this little tripod thing that I got from Five and Below. I'm going to insert a picture because it's so cool. It's $5. But, um... 
yeah we're gonna go to walgreens we're gonna go to Dollar tree and then we're gonna head to nc state but i do have a quick little 15 minute interview at um 12 so i'll probably take that in the car so i'm gonna try and make my trip to dollar tree and trip to walgreens pretty quick because they're right next to each other and yeah we're just gonna get this day started we're out the house it's only 11 30 so we're on a roll i'm pretty proud pretty proud of us you know i did sit down and watch a tv show i mean i did i sat down and watch tv show then my cousin called me so you know how that goes but okay so just got the stuff from walgreens they didn't have my print ready when i got there but the lady printed it off it's fine you know they will be having what they do but this is one of my prints that's going to be up at the gallery it's called staying a child's place which is also a piece that is incorporated into the gallery and it is also on my podcast i'll link that podcast down below if you have not heard it um wrote it when we first got into the pandemic when i was in my writing bag you know i'm still in my writing bag but it was a different type of bag you know what i'm saying because i was bored so we're gonna go to dollar tree and we're gonna go pick up some stuff from there i did look at the stuff in walgreens i'll probably come back after i drop off the stuff at nc state just because listen they had these um press-ons that i really liked so yeah we're gonna go to dollar tree and get some stuff and hopefully i'm not in dollar tree for too long and i can get out before my meeting i came to Ollie's because dollar tree didn't have anything again look what i found some dove bubble bath i didn't even know dove made bubble bath but they don't seem to have any nail stuff here so i think that i may end up having to go to like target or walmart which i ended up i need to go to target anyways so we'll probably have to go there but you know they do have these like halloween nail wraps but i don't wanna it's not halloween yet so i don't want to wear those i had a whole bin of stuff in dollar tree but we're practicing discipline because your girl is on a real tight 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 budget and um can't just be out here frivolously spending money on stuff that she don't need but i'm definitely going to come back and get the stuff eventually when i get some more coins but um i went into ollie's and they also did not have any nail stickers or like basically anything that i was looking for and that's so crazy and i understand that the press on girlies are taking over right now but like don't little bitty people like little girls don't they still wear like the nail designs i still buy the nail stickers for my goddaughter and she's five so i know that they exist i usually get them from dollar tree we usually get little little nail stuff from dollar tree and ever since it became the dollar 25 store it's starting to act real bougie so i'm just gonna go drop this stuff off at um nc state and then i'll I don't even know. I'll see if there's a Dollar Tree over there. Or I may even take a little a little excursion to my favorite Target. Because I have a Target down the street from my house. It's like five minutes away from my house. But it's this Target. I still don't know Rally. So I don't want to say North Hills and it's not North Hills. But it's, it's definitely by like the Wake Hospital or something like that. Um, Wake Med or something. And it's so nice. They have a parking deck and everything. So I'll probably like treat myself to a little extra minute of driving and go to there and just pick up what I need from Target. I don't need much, I just really need water. I've really been hooked on Target, you know, a little Target band, what is they brand? Good and Plenty or something? They have the best water to me. I have never, usually I just get the water bottles for Aries, but I drink it. Right. It's me! Okay, so we just dropped the pieces off. There are a couple people who are still have not turned their exam, it's okay, I'm gonna follow up with them. But they gave me, look at this! I program and I saw myself on TV. Y'all, they got a bitch for the world. <laughs> look, look at this girl. It's poking. She poking. But, um, yes. This is the other Dollar Tree that I went to and it had less than the other one. I should have just shut my mouth and been grateful and got the stuff that I had in my basket at the other Dollar Tree because this Dollar 25 store was bad. Okay, so there was an Uptown Cheapskate by Dollar Tree, so I had to come in. You know, I was just gonna wear something I already had because I was trying to save some money. But, I found these shoes and I was like, I can't believe them because they're $12 and they're so freaking cute. And I was like, I could do like a little baggy jean with a satin top type number. So I found some and I'm going to try them on. Okay, so, get this out of the way. So this is, I love this top, but it's not going, excuse the, the undies, but it's not going with these jeans. But y'all, look at these jeans. Like, they're Shein jeans. They are a little tight. I think I can loosen up the chains a little bit. But look at these shoes. You see what I'm saying? Like the shoes are the shoes are the moment, but I don't think the shoes complement the top. So I don't think we're gonna go with the top. Okay, so 
this is the color of the dress that I was gonna wear anyways. And I saw this shirt and I was like, this is giving artist, y'all. Is it giving? Is it giving? Does this go? Does it go? Let me know, let me know. Even though this won't be out by the time I wear it. But like, this shirt, I don't know, I don't know. Okay, so I am back home because um, I had a meeting. Well, I had a, I had a yeah, a meeting. Um, and I didn't want to take it in the car because I didn't know if it was going to be virtual or if it was going to be on the phone. So I came home, but it's good because I need to like regroup shopping exhausted me a little bit. I didn't find what I was looking for. I did get some heels though. I don't know if they're uh, heirs. Do you want to say hey to the people? Heirs. Don't be nudging my hand now if you don't want to say hey to the fans. But anyways, I don't know if they're going to look good with my dress. So that is just my dilemma. I don't want to look like a slur in this dress. It's a really pretty dress, but I don't like having my shoulders out. And I know I have my shoulders out now, but it's like if I have my shoulders out, then my legs have to be covered. And if I have my legs out, then my shoulders have to be covered. And this dress is a tank little satin dress, but I love it. It's so pretty. So I'm just going through a little um, dilemma, but we're going to get back in the game. We're going to eat and I want to check back in later. Oh. Wow. Oh. So yeah, y'all yeah, drove yesterday. Uh, oh my God. Yeah, and I, I, I didn't. I didn't readjust the seat. I guess it's also like not putting the putting the toilet seat back down. But you don't do that either. I do. I do. No, you don't. I do. I remember. Fake news. Okay. Look, it was maybe one time where one I did. One time is enough for me to fall into the toilet. But she didn't fall into the toilet. But I and could look, have. And look, but she didn't. And here we are. All right, so look. Look, today is the day. Her black hand, a conversational piece at North Carolina State University. Woo, it's going down. I'm yelling, Timber, you better move. You better dance. Mm -hmm. Woo. So, yes, here we are. Vlog extraordinaire. I'm not really a vlogging extraordinaire. I'm 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 absolutely new to this. She's true to this. Um, but uh, but yeah, you know what I'm saying we're about to about to uh, you know have us a have us a, a grand day. Ooh. Grand. The opposite of what these niggas are saying. I'm tired. Say it again, man. <laughs> <laughs> Say it again. The opposite of what these niggas is paying me, y'all. We yeah. don't have to have a conversation about payment and being an artist you because people me? really be lowballing us. And then they be trying to not do things the proper way. But it's okay, because next time, next time, I'm going to have a lawyer draw up a contract. Yeah. Because um, they yeah. played me. But, yeah, we're just going to chalk this one up. You know, it was a good opportunity. Hopefully, I get some nice exposure. You know, hopefully a lot of people come out. Um, but they definitely played me with this payment. Um, so, NC State, Collegiate, Universities, like, please be aware that you need to give independent artists the same respect, time, and compensation that you give artists who are established in our world known. Talk about it. Because one day, my name is going to be worth more than your breath can express. Ooh! So, take this as a discount. We only get one a year. The year is almost over. That's just all one. I got. That's one. That's right. And that's the bottom line. Because Alexis Lawson said so. Damn it. Big purr. <laughs> Arr. <laughs> we found some. We found some nail art. They are actually new. They haven't even dropped. Y'all see the zip? You see that? Can't even let me be great for today. And I got some gel top coat to go over. So. Well, not gel, it's gel like. But this is what people use to uh, do their press on. So I had to get some more concealer because mine does not match anymore. So we're doing a little something, something. We're doing a little something, something. Oh, I'm
found some nail stickers at Ulta, y'all. I paid $10 for these shits. They cute, but not worth $10. But I needed some nail stickers, and I don't wear um, press-ons. And then I get to the car, and they are not even peeling stick press-ons. They are like little tattoos. So, I have put all these little stickers on my nails. And this is kind of what I wanted anyways if I would have got my nails done. So, um, I'll probably, when I get home, you know, to make them last more, I'll probably put some, like, cute um, glitter on them or something. But I did get some gel, like, top coat. So, I only have one more finger to do. Um, and, yeah, we just going to get her done. We run a little bit late. It's so a little bit of traffic. But, um, oh. Dang, I broke the heart. I'm feeling the trouble and make me see.